Hey Vibe Makers, it's Lila with LB Novelties and we are back in fall mode in my planner. We are going to be planning out for the first week of November. I can't believe it already. We're planning out November. I still have my October in here because I'm pre-filming and it's the last week of October, but I'm ready to get started in November and we will be um, decorating for... November 1st through the 7th and I already have my little post-it here with the season's leaves and um, Also where it says hello November. I believe it says it in the sticker book So I'll share with you guys what I'm planning on using and I am using this Also for my memory keeping so this is my everyday planner um, where I just write down all my plans in regards to everyday home life <laughs> um so I have the seasonal fall one here from the Happy Planner. I've only used it for the traditional, and I'll show you guys what that actually looks like. The traditional color scheme, which is like oranges and black. So this is where, where we're at right now, currently. Um, but when you guys are watching this, I'm getting ready for November already. So I'm planning on using these leaves, and the reason I wanna use these leaves, of course, is so I'm going to get into fall spreads, but I want to use this um, Red Lyrics Girls. This one is Fashion Girls 005, and I love this girl right here, like these beautiful colors right here of her dress. I feel pull from these um, kind of deep tone greens, or I might use this girl. So I just, I'm not 100% sure, but I think I'm leaning towards her. I feel like it'll be fun to bring her in and kind of welcome fall. So those are the two, the sticker book and the sticker sheet. I do have some pumpkins left here from uh, Create with Mandy's Painted Pumpkins. So I might bring those in. And then I did end up getting this one at Joanne. Um, they had a 50% sale going on um, this past weekend when I, and again, I'm pre-filming, but <clears throat> um, I just, I figured I'd give it a try. I wasn't really wanting to get the florals because I already have a lot of florals, but I do love this one because it has like it's seasons of color and it is seasonal and it has a lot of cute um, items like this one right here was like the main reason I wanted to get it for um, Christmas coming up and holidays. I was like, okay, this might work. Um, and I like the larger Mambi stick style of stickers. So this is available at Joanna. You can also get it on the Happy Planner website if you don't have a Joanne close to you. And I do have my affiliate link down below if you want to end up purchasing one. But I decided to get the larger one than the Valley Pack sticker one. Um, I think this one will get more use out of like the, the big, bigger um, decorative stickers. Oh, this one's cute. Where is it? Oh, I like this one too. So I'm going for this one right here, but we'll see. So that's basically kind of the theme. You guys know I always pull some stuff and then I might end up bringing other stickers, but that's pretty much what I'm planning on doing. And let's get started for our first week of November and back to fall spreads. All right, guys, so I was planning on using these leaves, which I still love, but then I also saw these ones, and these look really beautiful. Now I'm not sure which one I want to use. Maybe I'll use both. And I'm just going to make it easy for me to just pull these out. And I can just always slide these back in. It's not a problem, but it's just easier to kind of work with that. And then I can flip through this without having to keep going back to that. I think I want to use this one that says pumpkin kisses and harvest wishes, or leaves are falling. Fall is calling. Because since it's going to be the leaves falling, I'm not sure. <clears throat> Maybe I could use both. Let me just check. I'm wondering if I could combine the floral with the... Do that there. Oops, let's not get stuck yet. And then... Let me just see this other one. I think the other one I could put on the top. I like this one over here actually. So let's start just kind of layering this. Put this down. But I see you could see the line, so I'm just gonna white out this one line over here. And then build our way around. Okay, that's enough. Okay, cool. I like that. It's really pretty right there in that corner. Oh, that is really pretty. Okay, and then I just want to bring out my girl because I feel like she'll be fun to bring in here. Just like a pop of color. Or should I put her on this side? I think I'm going to put her right here. I think I'm gonna do is just put my leaves along the edges. Oh, this looks 
looks so pretty. Okay, I'm just gonna start layering these now. this and then I do want to bring in some of the blue tones to go with her and we might bring the blue over with her with this oh that looks so pretty like, see how these colors just look really cool with her dress? Okay, I'll trim this in a second. Alright, so all we gotta do is just trim off this excess and we can use these extra pieces in other spots. So I have the Hooray Season sticker book here. And I brought it out because it has, you know, first, oh, I love this sticker book. Um, but they have these um, really fun boxes. So I'm thinking, bring out this one. Let me just see what it looks like. And I can wait to do for Monday. And I'm putting the angle because I do have these, these really fun, and I know I'm going to finish this, but I just wanted to see what I'm doing on this corner before. That way I know what um, color leaves I do so I can kind of pick the next one. So I think I want to do like this one, <clears throat> kind of coming out of here. So you can put it in this corner right there. And they're cut so they fit like that. Oh, that looks pretty like that. And then the other one I'll just overlay here. Let's just see. I wonder if I should do it like that. Oh, that looks really pretty. Just a little bit of the leaf coming on it. Love this. Okay, I think I'm gonna do that for a couple more boxes. All right, so before I do the rest of the boxes, I do wanna bring in, like I said, some more of these leaves. Here, but I'm going to trim it. All right, you guys. So what I'm going to decide to do um, is I think I want to make the leaves kind of come like I had said earlier, just to kind of come in this angle. So we're just going to do that. And it's like the leaves are coming in for pumpkin harvest and then she's ready for it. <laughs> It's always fun to do these because you just play around with the layering and then start kind of building a little story with your stickers. Okay, let's bring in some of these solid color ones. Let's do, I'm trying to see what color I need. I need green. Let's do this green. We'll do this one like this and trim it. And then we'll do a small like that. Okay. looking cool I like this and then I still have plenty of space for my boxes and if I want to add another quote um, let's bring in some yellow
little bit of that blue. I'm going to use this one again. I'm going to this design in too. Let's try and see how I can add this in. Like that. And then this blue one like this. That looks cool. Like that. Alright you guys, it's looking really cool. I like this look. Like I said, I just want to add a couple more just to kind of fill in some of these spaces just so it looks kind of even. I really love how this looks. I love the leaves and now that I kind of have an idea of this I can start layering my boxes, but it looks so cool. I love it um, So I do want to bring in some of that blue like I said So let's do I'm thinking I could do a box right here and we could do the green and the blue Like that because I love this look right here so I'm just put these guys right there because I need a box. So let's look for a box real quick um, I don't know if this one has boxes. I don't know if this one does have boxes It's not like me Oh yeah, right here, these ones. Okay. I'm gonna bring in an orange one, since I'm gonna do the blue and green. Okay, this one could be for Friday. So let's do this like this. Yeah, I like this color better. With the... That looks cool. I like that. Let's see. All right, fact makers. So this is my to do's for Monday. This is for one or Tuesday. Yeah, this will be my Tuesday one right here. And I still have space here. And Wednesday, I'm going to bring out this little checklist stencil that came in my, I believe it was the, was it the painted pastels? Or no, this was the Grateful Heart Be Happy box. So I'm going to do this for Wednesday. So what you do is just do a little checklist like this. I'm not sure if I want to do lines or no, no lines. Let's just see. I think it does need the lines. So we're gonna do the lines. Okay, cool, I like that. Okay, and then I'll do the same for one of those areas here. I could do it for Let's do it for Saturday and I'll do a box for Sunday. I'm trying to see, yeah. Because I want to do a quote, so let's do it for Saturday. All right, you guys, so I do want to bring a little bit of these leaves up in this top portion. I think I'm going to do it this way. And I'll put a box or a circle or something here, and then I want to put a quote also. And then let's bring in a little bit more. But I need, uh, do I not have yellow? Because I already used my yellow. So let's do this color. And we'll do it like this lengthwise. Okay, perfect. So the leaves are done. And then they do have these really fun priority. on the camera but all I did was add this little priority sticker and then poured in. It's looking very festive and full and I still got plenty of white space so the last thing I want to do is just add like a couple more boxes but I do want to add a quote because these quotes are so pretty. I love fall. Fall reminds me that change can be beautiful. Or us. Is it me but 
love this one because it goes with her green skirt. Okay, so I just moved this um, branch because it was covering up my quote. Okay, and then I just need to add a box for Sunday and one for Thursday, and I think this is pretty much set. Okay, so I just needed some boxes, but I couldn't find like the size that I wanted. So in the sticker books that I'm using, so I just brought out my jewel tones. This has really come in handy this season, and I just want it. I just want to incorporate some of this color and bring in some of this yellow. So I'm going to bring this one down here and I still have space here to write anything I need to get done for Thursday. And then I want to do the same for Sunday. Just put this box over here and I have space here to write out anything. Um, but normally I carry out my whatever I'm doing this weekend into both days. So whatever I list out, if I don't get it done here, I'll just get it done on Sunday. Okay guys, so the last thing is I did have these painted pumpkins. I don't think I'm going to use all of them. I'm trying to see just to add maybe one over on this side because I have pumpkins here. Um, I have these ones. I kind of like that one. Just to add a little bit of a pumpkin on this side. Again, I still have space to fill out stuff here. Space here. Plenty of white space. And I could always come back and add a box if I need a box. But I think I just needed that one pumpkin. Just to kind of carry the pumpkins on both sides of the spread. All right, Vibe Makers, the spread is done and I really loved how it turned out. I had an idea for one you know, way of how I wanted the spread, but it always ends up being something else. And I always love how it kind of um, transitions throughout the video and just seeing how it, it comes to life. So hopefully it inspires you guys to just have fun, kind of have an idea, but let loose and just see what um, comes about from decorating. And it's all about just enjoying it and having fun. So this is my pumpkin kisses and harvest wishes with fall leaves <laughs> theme, but I really love it. It's exciting to get back into fall leaves. I enjoy spo uh, spooky season, but I'm excited to kind of uh, get ready for fall harvest vibes, Thanksgiving, and then soon the holidays. But isn't that so cute? And I love how her dress just pulls the green from the quotes and the blue from these leaves. It just is perfect. I love adding my red lyrics girls. They're so fun to just plop into any spread. And I'm also enjoying this checklist. I'm thinking I might try different color pens too to kind of match, but we'll see. But it's like, you know, I'm slowly um, integrating this into my planning system and I'm enjoying it. And I like these pops of boxes too. So it's a really fun way to kind of use um, the spaces to fill out information throughout the week. And um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and stay tuned for more fall spreads and more fun content coming here on my page. I have something really cool that I'm planning out. So stay tuned for that. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. It really does help when you hit that like button. Subscribe to my channel if you are new. Welcome here to the Vibe Maker Tribe. Hit that notification bell to let you know when I've posted my most recent video. And as always guys, peace and love. Bye.